Hey fellow adventurers, welcome or welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's travel day vlog. I am so excited because this, this is the first trip of 2024 for me and it's a really, really good one. So today I am flying from Detroit to Naples, Florida with my brother. I'm gonna hang out in Naples for a couple of days there with my family, enjoy the sunshine, the pool, the beach, all of that. But then I'm gonna drive from Naples to Miami, Florida to then get on a Royal Caribbean cruise ship and go on my bachelorette trip I cannot wait. This is going to be such a fun trip. I'm so excited to take you guys along. So in today's video, we're going to be traveling to Naples and fun fact, we're flying first class today, which I'm so excited about because I've only ever flown first class once and that was from Detroit to Washington DC. So it was a really short flight. Today's flight is going to be about three hours. So I'm so excited to experience first class and feel all fancy. Right now, I just packed up my car and we're gonna drive to my brother's house to meet up with him and then we're gonna drive to the airport. So let's go. All right, I'm with my brother now. We're on our way to the airport. We had to check the house 20 times to make sure everything was turned off. I feel like that's like the worst part about leaving is you feel like you forgot to turn off a faucet or the lights or anything. But we checked the house and then we were literally leaving and Josh goes, wait, did I bring my suitcase? We had to stop and check, but we got it. We got it all. We got our suitcases on our way to the Detroit airport. So I needed to check my bag when we went to the airport, but I saw the line was really long. So I did what I always do when it's a long line inside, and that is I go outside. So if you go outside to check your bag, that is for anyone to use. You can do that. You don't have to be like a special Delta member or anything like that. Anyone can do that, but you do need to tip the bag people like a couple bucks, but that is a little tip. If there's ever a long line on the inside to check your bag, definitely go outside. Well, we made it through security checked my bag and now I think we're gonna go to the bathroom and maybe get a little drink before the flight even though what time is it 11 11 you know what that's fine um, but you know what I love the Detroit airport we were just talking about how nice this place is there's so it's like so big so high ceilings and great food great restaurants and yeah we're gonna go to the wine bar though after the bathroom Vino Volo, very nice little wine bar here in the Detroit airport. Don't even feel like I'm in Detroit. You know where it feels like? It feels like I'm in Italy. <laughs> we each got a glass of the more Vidur red blend, because that's totally how you pronounce it. Let me know what you think, how to pronounce it. Let me show you. Yep. That's what we got. So if anyone knows how to pronounce that, let me know. <laughs> they got the same lineup for about three years now. Uh-huh. And so since I've had them all, I yeah. know which one is the one to go He was for. just telling me, I was like, oh, this is a really nice glass. He's like, yeah, I've had them all here. Like, I, he just comes here apparently when he's not even flying <laughs> to drink wine. Because that menu is that good. Oh, the flight. Okay. That makes it better. We just finished up having our wine and now it's time to check in. So we're going to use the bathroom one more time and then go check in to our flight. Guys, I'm so excited to be flying first class. I feel so fancy today. So first impressions of first class, they give you so much space, which is so nice. Space in between both seats and definitely a lot of leg room as well. Before we took off, the uh, flight attendant came around and took our drink order and got us a drink, which was so nice. Uh, drinks are included, by the way, if you didn't know, in the flight. And then we just kind of sat there for a while as the plane boarded, but it was just so nice. We just chilled, had our wine, and then it was time for takeoff. I will admit, I think I made a mistake though when it came to my lunch. So I had pre-ordered the charcuterie board. To me, this doesn't really look like a charcuterie board. It was some slices of meat and cheese and not really any crackers. So that was a little bit of a disappointment, but everyone else's food around me looked amazing. And of course, my favorite thing in the whole world, the Delta cookies, guys, these are just the best ever.
And this is me getting really excited saying it's green because I was so excited to see green grass and green trees in Florida. Also, I don't know if this is weird, but I don't think there's any better smell than when you land in Florida and you smell that Florida air. Let me know down in the comments if you know what I'm talking about. Well guys, we have made it to Florida. We're here at the condo that we'll be staying at this week and it was just like a really great travel day looking back on it. Flying first class is so cool. Definitely like a bucket list experience. I felt so luxurious, like they brought you like a tray table with food and like real silverware and napkins and like my wine glass ended up finally coming in an actual wine glass at first they gave it to me in a plastic cup which I was like okay but you know what whatever it was such a cool experience I feel so blessed and lucky to have experienced that and I'm just so excited to be in Florida so here's kind of what we're thinking about doing for the next couple of days here in Naples we're thinking about maybe going to Marco or Sanibel Island and then doing an airboat Everglades tour so I'll definitely take you guys along those adventures and tonight I'm just gonna unpack and I think we're gonna go out to dinner and just like enjoy being in a beautiful tropical climate so thank you so much for watching today's video if you enjoyed it make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe down below so you don't miss out on any of the upcoming adventures I'll see you guys in the next video bye you cut me loose and set me free.